hello friends today in this tutorial i will be showing you that how to convert a image in into a distorted or deformed image like this you will see that this is the image you can see that i have converted this image to a distorted image and you can just see that how it is looking like this and also this animation so you, you can also convert into a gif animation also with the help of this python library so you can turn any image of your choice so basically this kind of uh, uh, web app will be useful in those uh, applications where you want to make any sort of uh, quiz kind of a application where you want to guess the celebrity or at any kind of person image so you change the image into a distorted or deformed image like this so I will be showing you how to do this effect to your image how to apply this filter to this image inside python using a library called as block filter so let's start building this application guys if you want the full source code about for this application you can refer to my blog post where i have step by step explained to you about this library which and i have given the example as well alongside alongside with the screenshot as well so just go to the video description link for the source code now basically i will close this window and i will open a brand new window and show to you from scratch so i will go to my projects directory and simply i will make a new directory here we will say image distort i will go into this directory image distort and now basically i will open this inside visual studio code text editor you can use any text editor of your choice and the very first thing we will do is guys pip install and here we need to install this package the package name is simple block underscore distortion d e s t o r t i o n this is a package guys just install this library oh sorry we have made a mistake here i think so if you go to my video description link this is the pip install module that you need to install here and now you can see i have already installed this module so simply we need to copy this command here from my blog post which is there inside video description simply paste it and this will install this module to you after installing it guys just make a simple app.py file a simple file will be there and here we need to first of all import this library so we will say that from skin so this is the module we need sk image sk image we need to import we need to import this uh, module which is image underscore as u byte this is the line that we need to write here so this is part of the library and the second statement we need to write here from sk image dot io we need to import another thing which is called as uh, image read which is im read and we also need to uh, uh, import image save which will actually save the image to the local file system so first we are importing image read which will actually read the image and then we are importing image save which will actually save the image inside the same directory which is the actual distorted image output image so after this guys we will again use the uh, this block distortion which is the actual library from this we need to import uh, distort underscore image which will actually do the business logic of this application which will actually turn the image to a distortion or deform image and uh, let me format the document that's it after importing all these dependencies guys we need to provide the input image which we will store it inside the input image variable so basically you can take uh, we need to pass the path of the image by using image read so here you can pass the image of the path here which is load an image from file so i can download this image from the internet you can take any of your images and turn this so i will let's suppose i want to take it uh, my blog image which is coding section i will save this image click save this and uh, i will go to into this directory which is desktop projects and i have called this directory let me see i have called this image to start image distort and i will save this image as profile.jpg so my image is saved here you will see this is the input image you will see this is the image now we need to provide the path here simply i will write profile.jpg as this is in the same folder 
after providing the input image guys we will actually distort the image we will call this as distort it and then we will apply the function which is simply we will use the distort image function and here we will pass the input image which is that's it input underscore image so now it will carry out the some logic and it will convert this image into a distorted image and uh, now after this we need to save this image we need to save this image in the same directory so now for this we will use our uh, image save method image save so here we can uh, save it in the same directory so we will say distort it distort it dot jpg that's it so after that guys we also need a second parameter which is image underscore as u byte and here we need to pass our distort it that's it this line you need to write here which will actually carry out the distortion process and now this is only 13 lines of code required to only achieve this filter effect which is distortion now i can run this application and show to you how to do this if i write here python app.py sorry let me write the name python app.py so on the left hand side guys it will take some time if your image size is large it will take some time after that you will see in the left hand side it has created an image output image distorted.jpg if i open this image you will see now it has successfully distorted my image here i can't you can't see my image here properly so this is called as distortion distortion filter or any sort of deform filter so basically this filter if you want to use if you achieve if you want to achieve this filter you need to go to adobe photoshop or canva or third party applications to achieve this effect so by writing a very simple python script you can achieve this filter and i think that this is a very awesome library which you can do that now i will turn this into an animation guys which is very much easy if you want to do this you need to import one uh, one other dependency which is uh, instead of dist distort image we need to delete this and uh, in order to turn this into a gif animation we can do this as uh, animate underscore image and comma the second library we can uh, we need to have is write underscore frames underscore to gif that's it so these are the two dependencies that we will need here in order to turn this into a animation gif animation so we will turn this into distorted gif animation so for doing this guys we will use this method here which is first of all we need to animate this so we will declare a frames variable and here we will use the animate image method and then we will pass the input image to get the actual animation frames so now to save this file guys it is very simple we will say write frames to gif and inside this function guys we will pass our output file name which will be let's suppose output dot jpg or you can say that uh, animation dot gif because this is a gif file so you need to write as gif and the second parameter we will pass the frames the third parameter is the duration how much time you need to for the animation to occur so this can be in millis millisecond i will write here 100 so this will go in for 100 millisecond so if you change this value the size of the image will also increase and it will take some more time so you can play with this value i in the meantime i can run this application python app.py so now it will take some time to create this gif animation so don't panic it will take some time and after that you will see animation.gif file is created here so now if i open this file you will see now this is a gif file so it is animating it so you will see 100 millisecond this animation is going on so basically you can change this image to any image of your choice high quality image as well let me take a high quality image and show the effect to you so this picture i have taken from a good camera so you will see if i save this image so if i save this as quality.jpg you can also take png images this is not limited to jpg uh, you can also take png images as well so basically if i uh, turn this quality.jpg and if i run this python app.py now in this case guys the image size is large so it will take some more time for the distortion animation process so 
if you have a large size image if you have a high quality image so it, it will take some more time for the processing to take place so don't panic so at the end of this it will make this file so just wait now it has created this file here animation.gif if i open this you will see now you can see that it has turned this into a animation of distortion or deform so this was the filter guys i wanted to tell you how to do this in python very simple so without it you need to go to an advanced program or use a third party service to achieve this effect so i found this library to be very useful in python so with 13 lines of code you can achieve this effect it's very powerful so you can also build an online tool just making this application i will in the future video i will try to build my own own tool inside freemediatools.com and allow the users to distort images online so this will be a great tool to have on freemediatools.com so in the future i will add this tool and make a video on this so thanks so much guys for watching this video if you like this video then please hit the like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you in the next video